Being an engineer, there's a, a ton of different avenues that I could have went, but I wanted to be a farmer. I started off with 13 acres and then slowly made my way up to a couple hundred acres now. I love all the challenges that go into farming. You know, we basically have to forecast what we think that the weather's gonna be like. We have to be a biologist. We have to be a chemist of you know, getting rid of some of the weeds. If anything goes wrong with our equipment, you have to do it. Every little detail counts, and we have to encompass and ingrain all that information to make the best possible decision. Well, Farm Credit was a, a huge resource for me. They were able to not only give me a conventional loan, but also be knowledgeable through the process of first-time farmer. Having all that knowledge and information actually was able to make me branch out and expand my operation. They can actually point you in the right direction quickly. Someone's always got a better way of doing it. So uh, just taking the ideas from someone else and making it your own. Being an engineer, you're very analytical. What I'm trying to do is forecast, do I need to reduce or slim down on fertilizer this year with what grain prices are? Being analytical and crunching numbers is is kind of what I brought to the table as far as in my operation of farming. We utilize test plots as well. We'll plant about 10 to 15 different varieties in a, a given field, trying to extract the data. This variety actually does better in this type of soil. Coming together and actually producing a product that you know millions of people will use, I think that's the most rewarding thing out of everything.